Welcome to the Semblex Solutions at Work mini video series. I am Brant Ruskowitz, the Product Development Manager at Semblex, which is a specialty fastener company in the Chicago area. In this video series, we will evaluate the latest fastening technologies available through Semblex and look at some of the potential applications for each technology. The topics for this year will focus on thread forming fasteners for high strength steels, innovations in self drilling fastener designs, and low capital investment self extruding fasteners, which are fasteners for thin sheet metal where you want to increase your length of thread engagement without needing an expensive drive system. Today, we will look at a new thread forming fastener called Rolllock HS, intended for use as a thread forming fastener in high strength steel applications. A problem that many of our customers face is thread forming fastener installation failure in high strength steels. Traditional thread forming designs are based around 60 degree thread forms, which is the same as common machine screw. These type of fasteners tend to start experiencing installation failure at around the 600 megapascal tensile strength mark. Increasing the tensile strength past 600 begins to increase your failure rate. The video shows a traditional polygon cross section thread forming fastener attempting to form threads into 1.5 millimeter thick 980XG3. In this case, the hole size is 4.6 millimeters. 980XG3 is a generation three advanced high strength steel with a 980 megapascal tensile strength. As this traditional thread forming screw attempts to engage with this 980 steel, the resultant loading on the thread causes the thread to bend until it eventually collapses. You can see that as the shiny threads here in this picture. These screws are case hardened to a minimum of 45 Rockwell C, but even with this hardening, they cannot drive into this steel. You see that the screws continually fail, even when there's a large end load applied. To solve the problem of thread collapse in high strength steels and enable the use of thread forming fasteners in these metals, Semblex created the Rolllock HS fastener. It utilizes a unique compound flank angle design which allows us to form threads into these high strength steels without collapsing our thread. We don't need any special heat treatments or special materials to do this. It's simply a different thread design. However, this thread design still uses a standard metric pitch and is serviceable with metric machine screws. We see that Rolllock HS is easily able to drive into each of the holes where the traditional fastener failed, as well as some of the holes that we didn't attempt to drive into. In this case, we're driving through the punch exit side of the sheet which is typically the more difficult side of the sheet to install into. We're tightening to five Newton meters. At the beginning of the drive, we're spinning at 225 RPM. We decrease this to 30 RPM at the 2.8 Newton meter mark to ensure a properly tightened joint and to avoid overshooting the torque. These last two holes on the 4.6 millimeter hole size portion of the plate were punched too close together. As such, we can't get two fasteners to sit next to each other without the heads touching. So we're actually going to remove one of the fasteners we just installed and reuse it and drive it into the hole right next to it. On the other side of the sheet, we have 4.53 millimeter holes. Once again, we're gonna drive through the punch exit side and right now you can see the traditional thread forming fastener continuing to fail in this hole size. We chose two different hole sizes for a reason. Rolllock HS generally likes a slightly larger hole size than most traditional thread forming fasteners. So for this steel, the nominal should be 4.6 millimeters, which is the first side of the sheet that we tested. The traditional thread forming fastener would like a nominal of around 4.53, which is what you see on the second half of the sheet. However, you can still see, regardless of which hole size we use here, Rolllock HS does not struggle to install into this steel. We're able to hit our five Newton meter tightening torque every time. We don't have any drive failures and we're able to create a good joint consistently. Rolllock HS also works very well in laser cut holes in both mild and high strength steels and also works well when there's a large amount of fall away on the punch exit side of a sheet, especially on thicker components. If you would like more information, have a question, or would like to discuss a potential application with one of our engineers, please visit our website at www.semblex.com. It's www.semblex.com. 
or send us an email to sales at semblex.com. Please join us next time when we look at the use of Rolock HS into laser cut holes in DP1180 steel.